think what's so interesting about Romina's character is that her looks don't factor into the storyline at all. Oh yeah, cool. <laughs> Was it refreshing to play a character like that? Um, definitely. Um, even more than refreshing, it's it, it's just to play a character that's just raw and that has so many flaws is what's you know exciting to me. And to play with such amazing actors in a Derek C. in France film, you know, um, I'm really an actress. I still go to acting school and. What I try to do is challenge myself in, in the roles that I play. And sometimes, you know, you take certain jobs and the challenges aren't as challenging. But for me, looks, the glamour, it doesn't really play in. I'm the first one to be like, hey, for this scene, I don't think we should have makeup. Not just for this movie, for any movie. I even did a big romantic comedy years ago with Will Smith and Hitch. And there was a couple of scenes there. I was like, I want no makeup and rub down my mascara. They're like, are you sure this is a studio movie? I'm like, yeah. So that's never been an issue for me. And I think if you see me out with paparazzi shots, like walking my dogs or something, I just, I'm not like, I don't need to get, I'm actually, you know, I'll get dressed up nice so I don't look like a hobo today. Um, I'm qu quoting Will Ferrell on that one. Um, but yeah, to me, the, the, I, you know, that all that's all secondary. It's about the work, you know? Yeah, that's what I loved about the film is that it actually starts off with Ryan half naked. Like, they don't objectify you in the storyline at all. I think another director probably could have started the film off with you in that state, kind of getting ready to go meet him or something like that. And I wouldn't have done it. There's plenty of times I fight on that. That's what people don't see. I have done nudity for a couple of films, three, just three films if you count this one. Um, this is very partial nudity, very, um, but um, I've managed to have a full career without having a, a, a simulated sex scene. And that is no accident. Um, so I fight on that stuff all the time. I'll just be like, no. So when I do something, it's because I mean it and because I think that the, uh, you know, that the, that the rule calls for it and that the, con you know, that it works. Um, when I did full nudity, it was for a film called Training Day, which Denzel won the Oscar for. So, you know, I ha I'm very calculated about that stuff. Very, very calculated. It's necessary for the character. It's not just for the sake Another of film, which I, my first big film, I had no makeup for that, you know? So yeah, it's always, it's just about, it really is about the work. And um, that's what's exciting for And me. you said in an interview you did with IndieWire last year that you're finally in movies that you yourself would want to go yeah, see. Yeah, I did say that. <laughs> Great quote. Uh, cool, thanks, <laughs> and I was properly quoted, so thank, thank IndieWire for that, cool. Um, yes. Though I don't agree that the other movies were not watchable. I that's think they're sweet. lovely. Thank you. Um, would you say that Holy Motors and Place Beyond the Pines yes kind of represents a new phase, a new chapter for you. Well, I career. think it started a few years ago. I think it started when I when I did a Bad Lieutenant with Werner Herzog. Mm -hmm. I was just like, this is on. I, I gotta work like this. I've gotta work with the Werner Herzogs of the world and just, you know, uh, it was just, that That I, I think was the first film that, that, that I was like, okay. And it started this whole thing of me just doing things that I love. Then I did this little film called Last Night, which my director doesn't get credit for, but it's just, you know, do you know it's a woman, Massey Tajadine, mm -hmm. so talented writer, director, and I just like bringing it up, not to give myself kudos, to give her kudos, because she was incredible, nobody saw it, so Massey Tajadine last night. Yeah, uh, Kira Knightley and she was Sam amazing. Worthington. Sam was amazing, so Guillaume Canet, <gasps> it was so good. Shout out to that movie. Thank Go you. <laughs>